I tell you a story about me and you Out on the water, surrounded by the blue They scream that only I'll be saved The toss off the line, but I just let it float away Yeah, I let it float away I let it float away I let it float away Float away Previously on Sailing Zatara. We spent nearly two weeks enjoying the amazing underwater world of the island of Bonaire in the South Caribbean off the northern coast of Venezuela. It's one of the ABC islands and it is known as the Diver's Paradise. We also practiced man overboard drills, explored the entire island by scooter, and just had an amazing time in this Dutch country. you by the fire listen listen there's something i must confide i know i said that it'd be fine i know i made it look like it'd be all right but i think i learned my lesson and i'm not gonna let you out of my sight don't get away Time we're reading our Panama cruising guide, figuring out where to go, what to do, how to get there. And then after that will be our Pacific crossing guide. Yeah. What? It is nice. I don't know what that is. Board, I guess. Hotels and stuff. Yeah. What? <gasps> what is it? They saw us on YouTube. Oh, hi! <laughs> After a day of checking in and getting tied onto the marina, we settled in to enjoy abundant electricity, Wi-Fi, and a long shower. We had to sit tight for a day or two waiting for a good weather window to continue west towards Panama. We visited with our new friends and Sailing Satara fans, Alcino, Steve, and Denise. They shared with us their dreams of sailing and their goals, and then they asked Keith why he decided to take his family and sail around the world. Hey 
I, I talk about it. I, I, I don't want my children to pursue money, to pursue wealth. I, I did that, and it got me some nice stuff. But at the same time, it's there's nothing there. What's there is this advent. This, this you know, here's here's the bottom line. I wasn't inspired anymore, and I wasn't inspiring anybody. This inspires me, and our journey inspires. Yes. <laughs> yes. And that is yes. what life's about. Yes. For for me, for me, you know. Then they took us out for an amazing evening and shared the beautiful history and rich culture of Curacao with us. Curacao's early history is dominated by slave trade, however the Dutch abolished slavery in 1863. When oil was discovered near here in 1920, Curacao became an, a major exporter and has one of the highest standards of living in the Caribbean. The Queen Emma Bridge was built in 1888 and was completely renovated in 1939. Originally, it was a toll bridge, and individuals without shoes were permitted to cross the bridge without paying the toll. However, today a toll is no longer applied and shoes are allowed. Thank you, Alcino, Steve, and Denise for showing us such hospitality and for following along on our adventures on YouTube. Checking out? Yeah. Checking out. Getting our exit peppers. Okay, so this is Abba A. Rival. Is that yes. Abba A. Rival? Oh, that's clever. Hi. Very clever. <laughs> awesome. We met this talented group of musical angels in the immigration office. They were heading home to Scotland after performing on the cruise ships, and they blessed us with their harmonious voices. <laughs> again it's red it's blinking he's the guy to talk to through curacao he's helped us out got us a, a slip and helped us get around he's taking us to customs an avid sailor diver man of the world right there alcino check him out when you're in curacao join us next time as we make our longest passage so far 700 miles five days non-stop to cologne panama